Okay, the last thing I want to show is how to encode all 11 songs that I have on this CD in one single command while minimizing the amount of typing that I have to do, minimizing the amount of data input. That can be done by taking advantage of the encoder's ability to read in multiple songs for input and then output the encoded data using variables instead of using hard you know hard typed words like you know track 05.ogg instead of typing in the exact name of the output file i can instead use variables it's kind of it might be a little confusing at first but once you under once you see what i type you'll you'll understand it and again i encourage you to read the man page to completely understand this so let's get started here so i start by typing o g g e n c and my the first argument i'm going to use is dash b192 to tell the encoder that i want to use 192 kbps encoding now the the command line for Linux and Unix like operating systems allows you to specif to put a backslash on the end of a command to tell it that your command is going to continue to the next line and I'm going to take advantage of that here many times so, uh, so on the first line I just said aug inc dash b192 now I'm continuing to the next line now the common the common data for this album the artist name is Candlebox, so I'm going to specify hyphen A space quote Candlebox unquote space and the album title is obviously the same for all 11 songs so I'm going to specify hyphen L space quote Candlebox, because again it's a self-entitled album, unquote space, and the date is the same, so I'll specify hyphen D space quote 1993, unquote and the genre is going to be the same for all 11 songs, so I'll specify dash, capital G, space, quote, alt, dot, rock, unquote. And then again, I'll use a backslash at the end of the line to tell it that my command is going to continue to the next line. Now, for the rest of these, I'm actually going to copy-paste from another window so I don't have to sit here and type it all. The part of the data that will now change will be the individual tracks. So for the first song... I'm going to, on the next line I specify hyphen T space quote then the name of the song is don't you unquote space hyphen capital N space quote zero one unquote and the zero one is the track number space and then I specify the name of the the WAV file for track one which is track zero one dot C D D A dot W A V then again, I put a backslash, uh, backslash on the end of the line to tell it that I'm going to continue this one command onto the next line. Then on the next line, I do uh, the same thing for the next track. Hyphen T space quote change unquote, which is the name of the track two, which is the name of the song for track two. Then again, zero two for the the, the dash capital N argument for the track number. Then I put in track 02.cdda.wav to tell it that those first two switches apply to that track for for this line. Then I put the backslash on the end and then I repeat this for all 11 songs on the album. So the third line you can see there, you know, dash T, the name of the song, the track number, and then the the data the track data track 03 cdda dot wav and again the dash t and the dash n will only be applied to that to that data track and then i'm going to you know continue this for all 11 tracks and as soon as i have all these entered in i will unpause the video